It's one of the biggest crime mysteries of the past century. How did Fred and Rose West become Britain's most prolific and sadistic serial killing couple? They derive so much pleasure, sexual and otherwise, from the pain of others. At their height, they murdered a girl every three months, claiming at least 12 victims. But how did the evil begin? It was suggested that his mother told him when he was 12, you know, now you're 12, you've grown up, you've got to have sex with me. There's evidence Rose also suffered sexual abuse as a child. We have incest here. We have incest being repeated through the generations. In their first in-depth interview, Fred's own family cast new light on the couple. Well, I always thought she was possessed with the devil. But was Rose's lack of morality caused by shock ECT therapy given to her mother when Rose was in her womb? ECT at this time was still fairly brutal. And did the head injuries Fred suffered as a teenager distort his personality? His dad said he didn't seem to think that he was the same person. With so many girls and young women disappearing, how did Fred and Rose get away with murder for so long? The police never particularly joined up the dots. Social services never particularly joined up the dots. This is the dramatic account of how Fred and Rose met and became killers.